everyone, White Rabbit here, and today I'm going to go over a Titan Attack for mid-level players. Now, um, I'm going to go after a Titan that is way too powerful for my account, but I'm going to try my best uh, for those of you mid-level players who are in stronger alliances, and that's where you want to be, but you're having a hard time with their Titans. Um, hopefully this video will help give you some encouragement and some guidance. Um, as you can see, I just took a hit at this Titan for only 14K, not really great, but all damage is good damage as long as you're not wasting Titan flags. All right, so um, Nature Elemental Barrier, so reflects 100% of all direct damage and status effects from the same element. So this is a Nature Titan, so I cannot bring any green heroes in. I mean, I could, but it's not wise. So, um, let's see what he does. Shattering Shriek deals 200% damage to the target and nearby enemies. The target and nearby enemies get negative 40% attack for 5 turns. The caster is immune to new status ailments for 5 turns. Alright, so right off the bat, I see I'm going to need some bear banners. This is not a Titan where I'd want to use my antidotes. I would definitely want to use bear banners to increase my attack. Um, if you don't have bear banners or the, the materials to make bear banners, um, antidotes are fine. Um, as long as you're, you know, repairing that negative attack so that you can get the most out of the Titan damage. Alright, so what I like to do with Titans is I like to do like a, a defense down, attack up if possible. So being that it's a nature Titan, as you all know the rule of replacement, fire burns the tree down. So fire takes nature. So I'm going to do 4-1 with Wukong. Wukong is great for Titans. Um, basically, he is going to boost your attack um, and also your special. You have a chance of missing, but um, you have more of a chance of doing incredible amount of damage. So Wukong, I find him to be phenomenal with Titans. I don't have him maxed out yet, but I'm definitely working on him. Alright, uh, the next hero I wanted to bring in is Bold Tusk uh, because he's a healer, and I'm definitely going to need a healer for this Titan. And he uh, boosts my attack, which I'm probably going to need. I want to get the most out of my hits. The next um, hero I wanted to bring in is Gormek. Um, he's a defense down hero. Again, I don't have him fully maxed out, but I'm a mid-level player, so I'm doing the best I can do here. Um, he's going to drop that Titan's defense, uh, which would be great. Now, if you have a Guardian Falcon and you're going in with a fire stack, um, a red team, I would use Guardian Falcon over Gormek. Um, but I am a free-to-play, and I have not been so lucky to pull Guardian Falcon. Um, the next thing I grabbed, just because it's what I had, is uh, Sumitomo. Um, I really like this guy. He's from the Atlantis. Um, I like him a lot because he has the counterattack, and he hits pretty hard. Um, so that means, you know, if... If the Titan hits me back, they might take a little damage because I'm definitely going to get hit. So having a little counter attack is going to just help me out because I am mid-level. I'm not very strong. So, And the next thing I had was Scarlet. She's going to, um, you know, do some negative attack to the Titan, which might help me out a little bit. Might keep me in the game a little longer. Um, she also has a pretty good tile damage here. Um so it's decent uh so all right guys so let me check out my troops i don't really have much for troops so um that's what i got uh, hopefully that keeps me in the game oh i could do that see it's always good to check your troops all righty i'm gonna go ahead and do this attack um let's let's get to it all right, so right off the bat, I'm seeing I'm not getting a lot of great colors. Um, what I'm going to do is a little risky. I'm going to um, boost my attack, defense down, and then I'm going to use Woo for some tile damage. Now, I know the board isn't looking pretty enough to do this, 
but it's worth the risk um, being that I don't think I'm going to stay in the game very long. Now, I did get a diamond. Um, I'm going to wait and see if I can hopefully get some more reds on the board before I crack that diamond. That's going to be great later on. Hopefully, I can survive long enough to get that diamond open. Seems like I'm not getting a lot of really good matches on this board, which is tough. Um, I'm going to go ahead and crack this diamond now. I don't have a lot of options. Now Wukong is dead. I want to utilize his ability. Um, oh, his ability is gone. Never mind. Um, the next thing I want to do is time stop. I want to take his, um, a, his special down. Um, gives, buys me a little time. Yes. All right. Now I want to heal up. Defense down. Hit him. And I'm going to go after that weak point again. As you see, I'm not getting a lot of reds. And I'm almost out of time. Hopefully, um, you know, I can uh, get something with that. It was like my kind of Hail Mary. I don't know. I hope that was helpful. 20K, that's really good for me. Um, <laughs> I feel pretty good about that hit, actually. This is a very uh, tough Titan to go after. Um, again, I'm mid-level player, so it sure beat that 14k. I hope this was helpful um, for you mid-level players. Uh, I did take a few risks there. There may be a few advanced players that might question my methods on that. Um, but I kind of used those specials early because I knew that I wasn't going to stay alive long enough or there was a good chance that I wasn't going to. So I wanted to do the most damage as soon as humanly possible. Anyway, guys, I hope this was helpful. If you got any questions, comment below, like, and subscribe. All right, bye.